heading to Avengers Endgame right now. As you can see, it's the opening night. You can see just how busy this car park is. There's literally no car parking. Normally there's car parking here. Um, at my nearest event cinemas, seeing this film in VMAX. I'll let you guys know what I think in the, this video as it is spoiler free, but I just wanted to show you just how packed it is for the film. Step one for a three hour movie. Snacks complete. This is it. Avengers Endgame on the other side. I'll see you there. Emotionally, mentally, I'm not prepared for this film. What's going to happen? Let's do it. I obviously won't show the screen due to spoilers, but you heard that evacuation. This happens three times I've been to the movies in the last couple months. Hopefully they play it again, but no one's leaving. It's a sold out session and we're getting sick of this thing happening at the movies. It's 1am, I'm going to put a spoiler review sometime this weekend, um, Endgame, I'm lost for words, it's easily the, the best Marvel film, um, or at least Singe Winter Soldier, um, you can't say much because the trailers don't give away anything, I obviously don't want to spoil it for you guys. I think this film works so well as a misleading concept. It's not what you expect. There's nothing wrong with the film in my opinion, besides the pacing sometimes can be an issue. Besides that though, this is just a perfect um, conclusion to the Avengers and all these solo movies, characters we've known to love and um, come to it's just devastating though um yeah there were some tears there was some laughs um i won't really give anything away but you've also got some characters popping up um some expected that you may have thought some unexpected um you have to wait for the spoiler video to know those though but overall it was a fantastic film um and it went for three hours, which went really quick. But, um, yeah, it served its purpose as the end of it all. And in my opinion, um, it did a fantastic job at doing that.